I'm going to take a minute to show you how to use the cross-section view window inside your model in VSP. And this is used to accurately match cross-sections to known diameters or images so that you can set everything up and have a really accurate model. Now in the fuselage, in a body type, if you go next to type, there's this show button. And in a wing, it's under airfoil. Now let's click on that bring up show and you can see it brings up the cross-section view window and here I've already selected this cross-section I've placed an image by activating this button and selecting a file and I've scaled everything so that my image in the background lines up with my known dimensions here with my height and width and what I did was you're able to adjust these strengths and angles to match this cross-section view in the image so that gave me a really accurate cross-section here in my model. Now, if we start to play with some of these parameters, you'll see that this window is trying to keep your cross-section centered smack in the middle of the window. So even if we were to scale this up or down, you'll see that the cross-section size remains the same. But if we come in here and start playing with our height, you can see that height scales down just fine, and it's mapped over to our model. But watch what happens when we get larger than our width. We're increasing height, but it looks like the width is decreasing. That's not actually what's happening. It's just normalizing by the maximum of the height or width to keep everything centered in here. So if we bring that back down, and you can see there it starts to get itself figured out again. And again, we're right back around 3.3 or so where we were before. So it's important to know what your height and your width happen to be, say from a three view side or something like that. So you can get some of these parameters already set and then the shape of the cross section itself can be manipulated using this background. And that's a really powerful tool. So that's how you access this window. That's how you can set up an image in the background and that is how you can use it.